Hey guys, what's up, Dream Machine Sam? Back with another video, and today we have another roster update, one for NBA 2K19. Um, so, as you may know, I used to play 2K19 a lot up until 2K20 were, was released free for PlayStation Plus. I was planning on just buying 2K21 and hopping straight from 2K21, well, 2K19 to 2K21, and not really having any problems other than that. Uh, but 2K20 came out, so I'm doing roster updates on there. I'm playing that until 2K21 comes out, and then until the PS5 drops, hopefully within the next, what is it, five months now? So, let's get straight into it. You're going to want to look at my ID. Just look at my ID. Do not fucking ask me what the rosters are. You will see them in a fucking second. I swear to God, people that fucking watch the video and they go, within their first, like, ten seconds of being on the video is, what's the roster name? Bitch, I'm doing the intro. Leave me alone. Look at my... Online ID, Green Machine Sam. Five rosters will pop up. You have the 2K20, NBA 2K20, roster update, NBA bubble. And that's with all the players getting moved off the roster if they did not go to the bubble or if they are injured or if they went home. That is that roster. Grab that one if you want it. It's not that fucking hard. Anybody that did not go to the bubble or left the bubble or is injured and leaving the bubble or anything like that. They are turned to a 40 overall, and they have shipped off the roster into free agency. Free agency has been overhauled. Badges have been overhauled. A bunch of stuff has been overhauled. So that makes that roster pretty good if you want it. It's not hard. You can move the players back on the roster if you really want to. Not all the players are on the roster. Like, for example, the season contract players for the Nets. I didn't fucking add all of them because I didn't fucking want to. The Rip Kobe Goat returns for one season. It's it's the normal roster, so the before COVID roster. But it has Kobe on the Lakers for one year to go win a championship. Trying to anyway. We have the 2002-2003 restart roster. It's from 2002. You restart. You can sim through. You can find fucking draft classes. It's not that hard. Look them up. The Legend League roster, the le the roster that is, has taken so much fucking time and effort, has a bunch of Legend rosters, has like the 18 Rockets, the 17 Warriors, the 16 Cavs, the 17 Celtics, the 07 Celtics, the 10-11 Lakers, the, you know, it goes on and on. I have a bunch of teams on there. Go download that one if you want to. And then we have the before COVID roster, basically, which is basically the roster as they were seen before COVID, minus injuries, of course. If you guys do not like any of these, you guys can find a different fucking roster update. It's not that hard. Simple. It's really not. If you guys enjoy this type of content, come back for more. The 2K20 was just updated yesterday. Madden 20 was updated two days ago. So keep that in mind. Anything that you guys need, let me know down in the comments. Can make anything easier. No, I do not have sliders. No, I do not have other shit for you. Sorry, I haven't even figured it out by myself. Just go look up Pop Boy, the Pop Boy sliders. He probably still has shit for 2K19 up on his channel. It's not that hard. If you guys like this type of content, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Turn on post notifications. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace. Only reason why I'm being a dickhead is because some of you guys are dumbasses. Woo!